Today we're taking a look at the GSI Spice Rocket. That's coming up next. GSI Spice Rocket. The GSI Spice Rocket has three stages from liftoff to deep spice exploration. The Spice Rocket has a capacity of 0.5 fluid ounces in each chamber and it has six chambers the weight is four ounces okay so out of the package here the spice rocket does come with these handy labels and it has a list of all different kinds of spices and these are just little stickers that you can put on the side to mark what you uh, put in your spice rocket okay here's the spice rocket out of the package and this just breaks down into three different sections here okay and each section is divided in half with a divider so each section has a divider in there and you can put two different spices one on each side and then all you do is rotate the top here from one side to the other okay we got a couple different designs here on the tops depends what spice you're putting in you have something like oregano or basil that you need uh, some bigger holes for it to come out and this one has a real big hole and the one on the bottom has some smaller holes for like some uh, salt and pepper or some garlic powder so you can break this down into a smaller unit if you wanted to just take two different spices here and just screw the lid on this and you could just use that or if you only have four different spices you're taking you can just screw another section on here and put your four different spices in here and put the top on here like that so it has a lot of different options that you can use this in different ways If you're going to do this and leave a section off, you don't want this top on, you can pop it off and put the other top on. So we're going to fill this up with some spices that I like to use. Okay, I brought five different spices, even though this holds six. Uh, there's one that I wanted that I didn't have, and that was onion powder. But uh, When it comes to spices, I usually just buy the cheap stuff. But I have paprika, garlic powder, one of my favorites, oregano, and another favorite of mine, Old Bay. Can't beat some Old Bay. And then I have some cayenne pepper. Okay. 
Okay, so in the bottom here, I'm going to put some oregano in here. Alright, we're going to put some Old Bay. we're done we're gonna have a nice seasoned log here all right next to the old bay I'm gonna put some onion powder in snap this top here that has the small holes in. All right, we'll put some uh, cayenne pepper in this one. I hope a squirrel don't come along and lick this log here because there's a lot of spices on here. Okay, so some of these spices look alike. So this is the cayenne and this is paprika. So we're going to keep them separated and I'll put the paprika over here on this one. Okay, so you can rotate this to what side you want like that. So make sure these are snapped down on tight or you might get a surprise. Alright, we're going to label these so we don't get stuff mixed up here. So we do have a sticker here for garlic. Right there. Okay, so these stickers are clear, and they're kind of hard to see. I did peel the garlic one off, and the paper and all came off with it. So I'm having trouble getting it separated here. So this might be something that you want to make up your own stickers and put on. These, uh, these seem very difficult here. I'll try another one here. And see how it works all right so there's another one that doesn't want to peel off wants to take the paper and all off so having a lot of trouble with these stickers maybe they could be a better quality but uh, probably the best thing to do is to make your own up and put on there or you can even use a sharpie and mark them sometimes a sharpie will rub off too but as long as you can keep it straight in your head what it is, you'd be all right. I guess if you're expecting uh, paprika and you get cayenne pepper on something, it might not be good. All right, we're just going to get her assembled here. spice rocket assembled. I got some oregano in the bottom here and see I'm getting these mixed up. I got too many that look alike. I know I got the garlic powder up here in the old bay over here and I believe this is cayenne and this is paprika 
and I got the oregano in here. I still have room here for one more. I'll probably go with some onion powder or something like that. Yeah, there it is. The GSI Spice Rocket. Shakes out pretty nice there. Switch it over to the garlic powder. Yeah, it works out pretty nice there. Go down here to this section. All right. Is that paprika or is that uh, cayenne pepper? Take a little taste here. That would be the cayenne. This one has bigger holes and it. it's going to come out pretty fast. All right, we got the bottom section here. And we got some oregano here. And we know that'll come out good and it has the big hole in it. All right, so there you have the GSI Spice Rocket. Well, thanks for checking the video out today on the GSI Spice Rocket. If you like the content of this video, do me a favor and hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell and click all so that you don't miss out on any future videos. I appreciate your views and your support and give me a thumbs up if you like this video and we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks a lot.